So what was the most challenging part of speech and careers? Um, so for me, it was owning it like when I started working on the idea of, let's say in the beginning, it was very vague. I wanted to build out some posture solution, like what it's going to be, right? Like, is it a device? Is it a garment? Like, like it can be anything. So I did a lot of research. I talked to uh, many, uh, many users, people who, who had exposure to products like this. And um, so I was like kind of deep into that work uh, and I was already working on Etalon, but I still called it my project. Mm -hmm. And I, I don't know why I minimized myself. I don't know why I didn't own it like a job my company and i remember i had this i had this conversation with a colleague of mine uh, we'll just like exchange some messages and in conversation with him i also minimized myself i was like oh yeah you might be surprised um i'm doing this uh this new thing um I'm building a posture correcting solution and i know it's really surprising to you and he was like no it's not and that was like such an aha moment to me. I was like, oh my gosh, other people seem like more, me, me as like more wholesome, like see more of me than I see of myself, you know? So it was like so crazy to realize um, that I was just so minimizing, I minimized myself. I didn't own that. I'm in this new journey. I'm the founder, I'm the doer. So that part was hard. 